What's up guys? I'm back today. This video is going to be a little bit different. I'm not, you're actually seeing my face and not just my hands. So I just wanted to jump on and, you know, do a little bit more of a, introduce myself and talk a little bit more about like what, what I want to do with my channel going, going forward. It's been a few years. Channel's growing slowly. I'm up to 3,600 roughly subscribers which is awesome i love all of you without you it would this channel would be basically nothing but it could be a, it could grow a little faster and i was trying to figure out what i could do to to get it going a little faster so i wanted to just add a little bit of variety to the channel there's i've got lots of ideas just got to act on them but you know instead of just doing product reviews of you know, cheap things. I'll probably still do some of that just so that you know, but I've got some ideas. I think maybe I might want to just like I said, add a little bit of variety. Last year, my channel, my channel's grown a little bit every year. It's getting better every year. So it's, and that's a good thing. So I wanted to try and figure out what I could do this year to make it grow even better, you know, like to where I can keep that that growth instead of take a hit or whatever because this last couple months has been a little lower than I'd like them to be haven't been getting as many new subscribers and all that but it's still growing by all means but like last year I was on average I was doing probably about a video a week until later on in the year once kind of the holidays month started kicking in I started slacking a little bit and I don't want to do that anymore again this year but like I said last year last year was a tough year kind of I mean it was a good year a lot of good things happened in my life but this last couple months financially has been pretty bad with Christmas and all that you know kids but the reason you know I'll get into that here in a minute but like I said lately it's just been my last few years has been kind of rough. About four years ago, my wife got cancer and and she passed away. She left me with my three kids and all the bills and all the everything. And it's been really tough. I am in a new relationship. I'm happy. We're going to be getting married soon. So it's, it's awesome. Her kids and my kids, they get along great. We get along great. So it'll be good. But a brain fart. But yeah, my that's where I've been, and I've just been doing this, you know, kind of on the side for maybe you know a little bit of extra ad revenue, which which has helped a little, you know, having one job and three younger ish preteen going into teenage year boys that eat a lot, and it's hard to do it on just one job. So I've been trying to do trying to get my fingers in ever in as much as I can to get a little bit more support for those kids so but that's why every every little single subscriber means a lot to me it doesn't you know I, I don't stress that you know I've, I've never actually come in and just really thanked my subscribers those that are subscribed and do kind of watch the channel on the regular there's probably not many of those out there that just kind of watch it that are watching for a video to come out but but I yeah so I might just get on and just do some bit random videos about maybe some of the news that's going on give my opinions on that me personally I am a 2A guy as you probably figure in some of my videos, I don't really, I don't really show my guns a lot, but you know, I don't really have a lot. I'm not one of those gun tubers that has hundreds and hundreds of guns that reviews a new one every week. I don't, you know, I've got maybe six guns if you count my pellet gun. I've got an AR, I've got two pistols, I've got a shotgun, a 22, and a and a pellet gun. Pretty nice pellet gun, kind of. But that's really it. So it's like I could do my gun reviews and 
no time and be done and you know because i don't have sponsors i buy my own gear and like i said it, the last few years has been really tough having single dad one job it's been tough so i don't have the, like the money to just fork out into all this equipment i don't have sponsors I, I don't think i'm big enough yet to get a lot of those but i'm trying i'm, I'm working on them i'm definitely trying to get that to that point but you know so if there's any any sponsors out there that might want to think about it in the future heck yeah contact me if there's any ideas anybody has of things to for me to to look at to review to do to the vehicle i drive an avalanche i've been trying to do some videos on my avalanche some repairs some updates upgrades type things on that as well I am an auto mechanic by trade. That's what I do all day. I'm, I work in an auto shop, so I get dirty. There was a comment on my on one of my videos said, "Dude, clean your fingernails out before you before you do a video. You look more professional." And maybe I do, maybe I don't. You know whether I agree with them or not. I'm an auto mechanic. I get dirty. Sometimes I have to work on diesels. If you know anything about working on cars and or diesels, they they get dirty. You can wash your hands four days and they're still dirty. But look, fingernails are clean. Where's my camera? Uh, yep, see, clean fingernails. I did it for you. There you go. But I'm not going to stress over that. I get dirty. I work in a dirty shop. If you don't like seeing my dirty fingernails, then I guess I'll try to try to keep them cleaner if that bothers you. But the thing is, is yeah, it's been it's been a rough four years, and I don't have like I said, the products I review, they're cheap. They're they're not cheap, but they're budget. They're more budgety items. You know, my best my best knife is a is a Benchmade. I went out and I forked out a little bit extra money for a Benchmade. So, but for the most part, and I'm gonna start investing a little bit more of my money back into production you know camera equipment like right now i'm just using my cell phone on a selfie stick sitting in my bedroom on a chair so that's that's going to start changing i'm going to do better i'm going to start you know investing a little bit more into into the channel i know that's a big deal too is you know you got to put more money into it you can't just pocket the money that you're making which isn't much I'm not making a whole lot you know, I, I really don't, if you go back, if you keep, if you, if you know anything about ad revenue, it's very little and you've got to, you've got to be very popular to really make a good amount of money. And, but I appreciate all of you. I do. The new subscribers that are coming in, I love you. Those that have been around forever, love you. keep them coming i want you know i want to try and make you happy like i said i'm gonna add some variety my son likes football he's really big into football and i like football so we might do we might do a little football talk i know that's not really a whole lot related to gear reviews and mechanics and gun stuff and but it's something that makes him happy and maybe you know, give it a try. If it flops, then I'll stop it. You know, it's just something that he would enjoy it. You know, maybe we'll even put it on, do a channel for him and let him do that on that channel. But we'll see. And I want to do something more like this. Maybe, like I said, talk face to face or face to camera and talk a little bit about some of the news that's going on in the world. You know, we all, we're all keeping up with it. There's YouTube influencers all over the place that talk about it. And, you know, but we'll see. Maybe I'll do some range day videos once the weather clears up. We got about what feels like 10 feet of snow out there. It's maybe like two. We've been hit hard. We've been hit pretty hard this year with snow. Mountains of snow everywhere from the plowing and the shoveling and the digging. And it just isn't quitting. It stops for a day or two and then starts snowing again. But. 
I guess that's what happens when you kind of live in a mountain, in the mountains. But anyway, I'm starting to ramble. Give me your thoughts on what you think. Maybe you know where I should go if if you're interested in what I'm doing. If you're interested in growing with me, I'm not the I'm not the best at what I do at, as far as give reviews. I know I've got a lot of work to do. I know my production is is not very good. I know that you know I'm I'm improving. If you want to improve and learn with me, these products I get, I don't do, you know, like I said, I'm not sponsored by them. These sponsored people, they probably get scripts to go by with all the information they need. I'm buying it on online. I'm opening it up. I'm checking it out right in front of you. I know nothing about the product beforehand. I just, hey, that looks kind of cool. I'll buy that and I'll do a review on it. And that's basically where I'm at. So you're, you probably know as much or more about the product I'm reviewing than I do. So... I figure, you know, teach me a thing or two, you know, comment, you know, if, if I've got something wrong on blade steel or whatever, or let me know. So I'm not staring the people, the other viewers the wrong way, or if, you know, let's grow together. Let's, let's do this. Let's figure it out. And so get, give me your comments. Let me know what you think on, on where I'm going. You know, if you want to see, news with what I'm you know with you know you want me to start getting into a little bit more politics I could do that but I'm not really a big fan of talking politics a lot I know where I stand but I'm, it's kind of changing a little bit I'm not you know it's politics are are tough right now because there's just so much division and so much you know I'm typically a little bit more right-leaning conservative I said I am a 2a but right now the career politicians out there they're they're corrupt on both sides so it's like what do you do you just gotta you just gotta vote for the least of the least of the evils you know which evil's gonna be the least detrimental to my life that's basically what the way I see it when I go to the voting booth I don't I don't vote. I typically vote one way, but lately it's been a little bit, you know, more issue related. And sometimes I, most of the time I don't vote at all. I just, I've, I haven't barely voted at all except these last few elections just because it doesn't really matter. And my vote does matter, but it doesn't really matter as far as who I vote for. They're there for themselves. They're there for the money. They're there to be to, for the power and, that's all there is to it. So it's, but you want me to start talking a little bit more about that, a little bit more about stuff that's going on in the world, over overseas, wars, weather, you know. Let me know down in the comments, you know. But anyway, again, starting to ramble. Thanks for your comments. Please like the shit, like the video, subscribe. Let's grow together. I Like I said, I do have some ideas. Stay tuned. Hit that bell so you're notified when I do come out with a new video. You know the, you know the drill. I don't have, to, don't have to remind you. And there is a little super thanks button down there. If you, fe if, if you feel obliged, if you feel moved by, by the spirit to leave a small donation to help out, I would absolutely appreciate it but you don't have to just a simple subscribe and a like and a thumbs up and a comment that would be awesome i do appreciate all of you like i said it's you that makes this channel not me i just i'm just the one doing the stuff but if it weren't for you the subscriber the viewer i'd be nothing so i appreciate it thank you all stay tuned for more videos and I will see you in the next one.